Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see from the title, today I am trying a face mask. Now this is something that has been covered quite often on YouTube, but I thought I would do my own version because I just don't feel that a lot of the videos are clear enough. They don't tell us how long they've been using it for, we don't see them applying it, and sometimes they don't even tell us what they put in the face mask. So I thought I would do a video and try and make it extra clear, and hopefully I've put in all the relevant details that you need to know. So I'm wearing this face mask for seven days. I'm applying it every single day after my everyday skin regimen. And um, I keep it on for half an hour approximately. Everything will be shown in the video. So my skin is oily. I have that type of skin that if I get a spot, whether I touch it or not, it's going to darken and give me a bit of skin discoloration it's going to leave a scar so i'm hoping to try and fade um marks naturally i'm trying to avoid any harsh chemicals on the skin especially on the face because you don't want anything harsh on your face i feel like a lot of videos that when people are trying and stuff it's not very honest my videos i've got nothing to hide i will show you before pictures and after pictures and any other information that I found during the week. I've got some clips of me applying the face mask and also just making the face mask at the beginning. So make sure you hang around. At the end of the video, I will give you the lowdown, tell you what happened to my skin after seven days. All right guys, so this is how I'm gonna be making this face mask. So I've got all my ingredients right here. I'm using um, natural yogurt. Um, I suppose it doesn't matter if it's like whole milk or not, but this one is whole milk. So I'm going to put about um, like not, I don't really have any specific measurements, but I'm going to estimate how much I need. So I'm going to put about that much for now. And then I have some honey. This is like the really cheap um, type. This is from Tesco Value. So I'm gonna pour the honey in there. Yeah, it should do it. And then I'm adding some um, apple cider vinegar so this is the Bragg's um, organic one it's a really popular version of this apple cider and I'm gonna put I want to say about 10 mils in there so this is what it's looking like I've also got some lemon oil. I'm not sure if you can see that. Um, no, you can't see that. It doesn't really want to focus, but this is lemon oil right here. Here we go. Lemon oil. I'm going to put two drops. I usually put this with my moisturizer at night. Oh, that was free. But yeah. And then last but not least, the star ingredient is the turmeric powder. So, turmeric, this is ground powdered turmeric, and I'm gonna add that just until I think it looks, it looks good, looks like it's enough. And I'm gonna and now I'm going to mix that in. I think I'm going to put a bit more because it's not as concentrated as I would like it to be. Yeah, that's looking, looking a bit better. 
And that is pretty much it. That is the face mask. I'm also going to add a bit of um, flour because I want it to be a heavier consistency. I mean, it's it's not as thick as I would like. So flour will help thicken that up. I mean, obviously, obviously you don't want um, the mask running down your face. So if you need to thicken it up, don't hesitate to add in some flour. Okay, I think I might have added a little bit too much. Actually, no, it's not too bad. I might leave it. I might leave it at that. So this is what it looks like, guys. So that is the face mask. Very easy to make. I'm going to put it on every day for a week and I will be back to you with the results. Peace. Laters.
now that you've seen the clips i hope everything is crystal clear um so what's happened to my skin in seven days seven days of using the turmeric powder did this so i went from this to this do you see the difference <laughs> the difference is small but there is a difference there's only so much that you can pick up in the picture i guess the lighting could be better and the angles could be better but i can say that i saw a difference in the seven days that i used the face mask my face was brighter and my face felt um it felt more moisturized i felt like my face was also tighter and my pores even shrank a little bit because i do have big pores around my cheek area but I felt like they were a little bit minimised after using the products. So I would suggest you use this face mask for maybe a month to get better results. But from this seven days, from these seven days of using it, I can tell that um, it does work and it is a great mask to try. I'm happier because um, even though obviously it's the, the marks are not going to disappear in a week, I can see that it's faded slightly, but it has faded. I don't feel the need to put as much makeup. I feel like um, I can use less foundation to cover up the marks. I had to gradually build up the amount of makeup. Now I can get away with using a little bit less. So that alone shows me that my skin is better. My skin did break out, but that probably wasn't because of the turmeric. That was probably because of the fact that i changed my skin routine um and the products are going to be listed below i, I didn't really show it in the video but i will put what they are in the description bar make sure you wear sunscreen because the effects of you know the lemon and the um yogurt can be quite harsh on your skin so when you do go out you want to make sure you have a very high protecting sunscreen make sure you should be wearing that regardless of whether you're doing a face mask or not but make sure you especially have it when you're putting things that are very strong on your skin make sure you don't have any open wounds because you're using vinegar i actually had a little burn here because i relaxed my hair and um yeah it killed it killed me <laughs> so just bear that one in mind i loved the fact that I didn't have to wear it for long because some masks you have to see it for like I don't know an hour before it really dries so it did the job and I didn't have to sit down for hours oh yeah it's really really messy it's really messy when you especially if you put it down like around your neck as well when you're washing it it's gonna come out in clumps and it's gonna mess your whole bathroom up so i found it easier to just like have a whole bath instead of trying to wash your face over the sink um so i'll be prepared for that so what else what else what else what else what else lemon juice burns your eyes don't get it in your eyes you will hurt yourself i accidentally dropped some lemon juice in my eyes and my eyes i'm not even gonna lie they were i thought they were gonna fall out my head because it burns like no man's business okay lemon juice eyes don't mix don't do what i did apple cider vinegar is a mask it has so many health benefits that i suggest you just buy it anyway um people wash their hair in it you can drink it daily and obviously put it on your skin so yeah it's a very great thing to have in your house oh one thing i need to say oh my gosh i almost forgot this wear gloves like wear gloves because i did not wear gloves and i ended up having yellow cuticles which is really, really disgusting <laughs> make sure you use gloves um and avoid messing up your nails girl <laughs> so if you haven't already pick up the products and try it for yourself and come back and tell me what you think because i want to know that it's working for other people as well so that is the end of my video make sure you come back next week for something different thank you for watching and i will see you next week